So, fuel economy in the Shelby GT350. <laughs> that's what I have to say. I really like thereof. So, that's my gauge. And that's how much fuel I got left. And this is pretty much what I've done on this tank. So, I barely do 300 kilometers on a tank. Average 18.1 liters, 100 kilometers. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty bad. Okay. Oh, it's pretty much empty. And put the Chevron 94. We are in, uh, that's the price of gas right now in Canada, and we're in uh, April of 2019. This is my trip too. As you can see, I've done over 1,100 kilometers on this one, and I'm still averaging 18 liters, 100 kilometers. So uh, really, uh, yeah, this is pretty much the average you're going to get. I don't drive it super hard. Yes, I like to redlining here and there, but uh, this is on my normal commutes where I got like, you know, boulevard speed, a little bit of highway speed, uh, traffic, bumper to bumper. But yeah, I'm pretty, pretty much averaging the 18, which is uh, not really good. So that was the fuel economy on the Shelby GT350. Uh, my car is a 2017. So basically don't buy this car if you think you're going to get good mileage because you're not going to get good mileage. You're going to have, you're going to have a lot of smiles though, but not good mileage. By the way, I put always like uh, the good stuff in it, the 94 octane. So I just thought I would let you guys know, whoever is considering maybe buying a Shelby or um, if you guys, if there's owners out there that get better mileage, please post it, leave me comments. I'd like to know how you drive your car. So yeah. All right, guys. So cheers. Don't forget to subscribe, comment if you like it. Okay, ciao.